Once you came to Los Angeles, you probably saw that a lot of people that had chosen the artist path, yep. it was a little trickier to actually, you know, support a family. Sure. How did you decide to incorporate, um, you know, your knowledge of contract law and all these other things uh, with the creative? Well, it's interesting because the biggest thing with, with law school is law school doesn't really, it's not all about teaching you the law. The biggest thing for me with law school was that it, it teaches you how to think and it just rearranges your brain in such a way that you can now approach any problem and really be able to uh, deconstruct it in a different way to find an eventual solution. And uh, so when I got out here, it was, you know, I didn't go to film school. Um, and so now I needed to figure out how to break in, just like the, you know, 100,000 other people that do that every month. And, um, but I looked at the problem of breaking in in, in a, different way. I think I was thinking about it differently because the line of screenwriters that are very talented, the line of directors that are very talented, those lines are very long and it's very competitive. They're all trying to go through a couple different doors. And for me, I wanted to try to figure out how to differentiate myself in the marketplace, find a different door in, into the industry. And, and I come from a really interesting, varied background uh, where you know, I was, I was a heavy creative writer in, in high school. I played a lot of tabletop role-playing games, like Dungeons and Dragons, but not Dungeons and Dragons, things like that. Um, they, uh, when I was in college, I wrote for the stage a lot. I uh, invented board games to sell off to licensors and manufacturers, which is sort of this bizarre hobby. Then once I got into law school, obviously I had my, my, my legal training, uh, but I also wrote and produced uh, for the screen while I was in law school. So I, so, Understanding sort of these bizarre skill sets that I have, I wanted to figure out how to leverage all those things to help differentiate myself in the marketplace to try to find a different way in. I quickly hooked up with a couple people once I was out here. One guy that had a comic book and a technology background, another guy that had a music background, he had 20 years in the music industry, and uh, another guy that had this uh, branding and marketing background. So we were all sitting around the table working on a pilot project, and um, we thought, okay, how do I how do we use all these other things that we have as a way to help leverage our project in a different way? How do we create this, this pilot, but at the same time incorporate a board game component, incorporate some technology or a comic component? How do we approach it in a brand building way rather than entertainment way? And uh, it was really this fascinating subject for me, and it was a fascinating problem to try to solve. Once we started trying to do that, um, then that kind of got me to, into the area of transmedia. Um, but I don't think I would have done, could have done that if I hadn't analyzed the problem differently uh, from a legal perspective. Uh, because it, there's, there's, you know, the industry is, uh, is wildly complicated, uh, but at the same time, it's very similar to the, the way it's been run for the last 50, hundred years. And so for me, just sitting back, coming in completely fresh eyes, I looked at the way the industry was built and the way it was constructed, and a lot of it didn't make sense. And then a lot of the, the path that most people were taking seemed to be uh, not a logical path because it was like running headlong into the problems rather than trying a different path to solve the problem. Einstein always said that you can't, uh, you can't solve a problem with the same thinking that caused it. And so, so I looked at the problem, looked at it differently, and thought we could take a different path. And so, uh, so that, that got me to where I am now, which is using all the tools at our disposal, all the mediums and platforms at all our disposal in order to try to attack the, uh, the industry in a completely different way. So where most people attack sort of the industry from a right brain creative, yeah. you were coming from this left brain sort of analytical, critical thinking. Sure. Interesting. So yeah. that's that's where you said you, they sort of taught you a different way around it. Yeah. Whereas the long line was thinking from this right brain. Well, if I create this amazing story, it doesn't matter. I'll be let in. Yeah, exactly. And that's it, you know, and it it's interesting because I'm not even want to. I don't even want to say that's that's the wrong way because uh, it's it's the more competitive way. And so for me, uh, you know, you can have a you can have a lemonade stand in a neighborhood and, it's, and it'd be great. Uh, but if there's a hundred other lemonade stands that pop up in your same neighborhood, you have to start looking at how you approach your business differently. Uh, it's not just make how to make better lemonade. 
because because at a certain point it's really difficult to make better lemonade, right? I mean, and, true, and yeah. all these other people mm -hmm. making lemonade are going to try, be trying to make better lemonade, and then it just becomes very very difficult to try to stand out in the lemonade business when there's so many people trying to make lemonade. And so it's not just the quality that has to improve, which that that's sort of a given. We you also have to just approach the the business of it from a different way in order to separate yourself from the marketplace. Most people, we, most people say, if I can't make better lemonade, then I'm just going to do something else, uh, which I don't think is a, uh, I don't think is the answer. Uh, because if, if, if God puts you on earth to make lemonade, you make lemonade. If you're supposed to be a screenwriter, you'd be a screenwriter. Um, but you have to approach it differently in order to, to be competitive.